What is up guys, I'm the Gutsy Gamer and welcome to Pokemon Gold, how's everybody doing today? 
up, Patrick? How's it going? You're just in time. So we have moved on to Gen 2. Hopefully you guys can hear me okay. Hopefully, hopefully the game is at a good volume. But yeah, Gen 2. We got the first 151. And we're on the road to the next. Ah. This is my favorite gen, so I am so excited. Let's jump in. Go in the options. I want fast text. Uh, let's see. What? Or stereo. Hmm. Ooh, it's got like a little side to side. Nah, we'll keep it mono. I like this frame. We'll keep this frame. Hmm, what? You woke me up. Will you check the clock for me? What time is it? It is... Let's see... It's five o'clock. How many minutes? Uh... 48. Yeah. Yikes, I overslept. Yeah, because it's like... Too much night time. Hello, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world's inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon. People and Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. Now, what did you say your name was? I'm Gutsy. Gutsy, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. I'll be seeing you later. Neat. Alright, I noticed a quirk with the audio, so give me a sec, guys. I'm gonna uh, put you right on uh, my lovely face here while I fix this really quick. Let me cut the sound here off for a second. Hopefully I'm not too loud, because it kind of looks like I'm a little loud, but you guys let me know. Let me know if the game's too loud or if I'm too loud. Bump the mic, sorry. The brim of this hat is so big. All right, I think we might have to move the stereo. This is weird noises. I have it. I'm pretty sure I have it set correctly. We'll see how that goes for us for a little bit. Oh man, this is so nostalgic. Hey, Patrick. How's it going, dude? Am I coming out okay? Is the game coming out okay? Alright, thanks. Been experimenting with recording Switch games. Nice. Oh. Oh, Gutsy. Our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted you to do something for him. 
Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Here you go. Aw, oh, yeah, Pokey gear. I got a big ass wrist strap on, on me. Also, uh, Eevee, Eevee's here with me. I just, I just remembered. Gur. Gur is, uh, right, right here. Yeah. She decided to come along for the, for this journey as well. It's essential if you want to be a good trainer. Oh, the day of the week isn't set. You mustn't forget that. What day is it? Today is Wednesday. Is it daylight saving times now? Yes, it is. Yes. By the way, do you know how to use the phone? Yes. Yes, mother. I am 29 years old. Well, actually, to you, I'm just 10, I guess. <laughs> but yes, I am, I am an old man now. Don't you just turn the pokey gear on and select the phone icon? Phone numbers are stored in memory. Just choose a name you want to call. Gee, isn't that convenient? So it's probably nighttime. That's actually good for me because then I can catch like hoot hoot and stuff. Oh yeah. Hold on. There's not enough ambient lighting here. You guys aren't seeing me correctly. There we go. Lots of light in here. It's important. When you're recording stuff, or streaming, or whatnot, lighting. That's like rule one. And I forget all the time. Okay. Okie dokie. Anything in the fridge? Fresh water and tasty lemonade? Oh man, I could go for some lemonade right now. Yo, Gutsy! I hate Professor Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Wow, your Poke gear is impressive. Did your mom get it for you? Yes. Hey, look, should we call this guy Horden again? So this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What are you staring at? Holy crap. Gutsy, there you are. I need to ask you a favor. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Could you look into it for us? I'll give you a Pokemon for a partner. They're all rare Pokemon that we just found. Go on, pick one. Uh, I think you know what I'm going to pick by... The, the the art I have down here. Not you. Oh yeah, my little toad dial. Sure, let's give him a nickname. Let's see, what's a good nickname for a toad dial? Hmm. Hmm. I'm not going to be very creative with this. I'm just going to call him Croc. Did I do it? No. Delete. With a C. Croc. Or maybe we should be like all trendy with it. Do with a K. You know what? I got a better nickname now that I, I've introduced a K into the mix. I was thinking like maybe one of the enemies from uh, Donkey Kong Country. Because they're all Kremlings there. Huh. Trying to remember some of the names in that in that game for the the Kremlings. Whatever. I'm just gonna call him Croc.
Mr. Bugamon lives near Cherry Grove, the next city. It's almost a direct route there. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should uh, heal it with this machine. Oh, here's my phone number. Call me if something comes up. I got Elm's phone number. Alright, later. Gutsy, I want you to have this for your errand. Nee, thanks for the potion, dude. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. Alright, Oak has uh, several aides. It's just him. This guy's a small-time professor. Pokemon hide in the grass. Who knows when they'll pop out. I can't tell if it's nighttime in the game yet. I think it won't be till a little bit later. Our first encounter. And it's a Pidgey. <laughs> That's right, we're going to have to grind in this one. This one's going to take way longer than... than, uh... Let's go, Eevee. Oh, man, that... that experience point gauge is cathartic. Feels good to see it go up like that. Yo, how are your Pokemon? If they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of the grass. Yes. Yes, I will. Alright, HMs are coming back. That means they need to get an HM slave. What's a good HM slave for this game? I wanted to take a break, so I saved to record my progress. I should do the same. Hey, there's our first Johto Pokemon, but I don't think we have any Pokeballs yet. Do we? No. Oh, just destroy it. Not getting any in-game sound. Oh, okay. Cool. I had to mute it for some reason. There you go. Thanks, dude. Thank you so much. Let me know if that's too loud or not loud enough. This setup can sometimes be confusing for me. Sounds all right. Thanks, man. Oh yeah. It's a fruit-bearing tree. Hey, it's a berry. We're gonna give that to Croc. Oh, it just became nighttime. Oh, I remember that was like the coolest thing about this game. Now we're gonna run the like hoot hoot and stuff. Oh, that's right. We're gonna have to do, like, breeding and stuff in this game as well. Man, Gen 2 is the best. I'm waiting for Pokemon that appear only in the morning. Well, you're gonna be waiting for a long time. It just became nighttime. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone's a rookie at some point. Hey, man, I ain't no rookie. I just... I just- my Pokemon's a low level! What do you, I just moved here to Johto. I'm from Kanto. If you'd like, I could teach you a few things. Nah, I'm good, man. Thanks, I appreciate it. Oh, it's something I enjoy doing. Fine, come see me when you like. I'm sorry, man, but... I've got places to be. Did you talk to the old man by the Pokemon Center? He'll put a map of Johto on your Pokegear. Ooh. Let's do it. This guy? Maybe I should talk to him then. Locking tutorial behind the... Or locking the map behind the tutorial. 
All right, I'll heal your old man. I know you like doing this. Yes, yes, Pokemon Center. Yes, you hear your Pokemon. Free healthcare for Pokemon. I, I wonder how it's like for people. Do people have to pay? I, uh, that's actually concerning. There's no, there's no people hospitals. I only ever see Poke, Poke, uh, Pokemon Centers. Oh yeah, I should buy Pokeballs. Yes, yes. Cool, cool. Like a battle people. That's always fun. Gotcha. Here. It's my house. Thanks for your company. Let me give you a small gift. Map card. Thanks, old man. Thanks, old man. Am I broke? Do I have any money? Did mom give me any money? Oh, yeah, she gave me plenty. I saved up my allowance. Oh, but there's no Pokeballs. That's cheap. Come on, man. What kind of... What kind of Pokemart is this? You don't have any Pokeballs? What the frick? When I was walking in the grass, a bug Pokemon poisoned my Pokemon. I just kept going, but then my Pokemon fainted. You should keep an antidote with you. That's actually a really good uh, advice for me. I should get some antidotes. They're fresh out of Pokeballs. When will they get more of them? There's a, there's a Pokeball shortage. I haven't healed my Pokemon. Proc took a little bit of damage. Good evening, you're out late. Welcome to our Pokemon- Listen, it's only 6 p.m. It's not that late. Yeah, more battling. I need this Pokemon. This is a night only Pokemon, but I don't need Pokeballs. Love this battle theme. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, the uh, catching Pokemon theme from uh, Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu wasn't feeling it. I didn't like it at all. I would have preferred the Pokemon Go catching theme over what they gave us in Let's Go Pikachu slash Eevee. Man, it's been like a while since I've played this game. This is gonna be exciting. Another berry. What's up, dude? You know, Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. Aw, oh, free berries. Don't don't tell him that uh, I took the berry off his tree as well. That's also a nighttime only Pokemon. Oh yeah, level 7. Rage, that's not a good move. We need a water move. Mr. Pokemon's house? It's a bit farther ahead. Gotcha. And then, yeah, these guys are battling. I thought this was really cool back in the days. Like, oh my god, they're actually having a Pokemon battle. Go, Rattata! Tackle! What? This is a big battle! Leave me alone! <laughs> what a what a fun way to impede progress. Ooh, berry tree. What a what an interesting name for a berry. Pssn cure berry. 
<laughs> Mr. Pokemon's house. I mean, that was pretty much the translator just being like, uh, I don't get paid enough for this. Hello, hello! You must be Gutsy. Professor Elm said that you would visit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Gutsy received Mystery Egg. I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm would know it. Aha! So you're Gutsy. Oak, did you forget me already, man? We we met in Kanto. I'm, I'm from Pallet Town. I know I changed my hat backwards and everything, but uh, it's me, man. I'm just kidding. I'm Oak. I'm a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, is this a rare Pokemon? Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon are our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Aw, oh, yeah. Now we're officially in this. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get the Golden Rod for my usual radio show. Gutsy, I'm counting on you. He just hands, like, a kid he barely knows. Like, here, do this! You return to Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. I'm depending on you. So you got no bed in here, do you sleep on the couch? And what's this supposed to be, like, wires? H Hello, Gutsy? It's a disaster! Uh, uh, it's just terrible. What should I do? It- oh, no. Please get back here now. Alright. I think this border actually fits really well with the battle screen. I'm glad I picked it. Ooh, nice EXP. I wonder if they have Pokeballs yet. Man, these hoot hoot give a pretty decent experience. It's a good thing I waited till nighttime then. You guys have Pokeballs now? This this is a trash mart. No Pokeballs, dude. You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. A wimp like you? Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Our first trainer battle. 
question mark wants to battle. I should probably just use Rage, right? I'm just gonna get madder and madder and Croc's just gonna destroy this Chigurita. Yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah. Ooh. So it looks like attack is definitely... Yeah, there's special attack and special... Oh, yeah, they spit split that in this gen. The only thing that they didn't do in this gen is they didn't actually split the... the attacks themselves. So, like, a lot of water moves are... are special attack. Hmm. Are you happy you won? Yes, I am. My name's... I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. Apparently, it was a young male with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? Hmm. My buddy Jordan's not like this guy, so I'm, I'm just gonna call him Silver. Yeah, it's boring, I know, but... We're gonna have lots of rivals in this, uh... Full playthrough thing. Okay, so Silver was his name. Thanks for helping my investigation. Alright, what happened? Gutsy, this is terrible. Oh, yes, what was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Here, take this egg. This? But, is it a Pokemon egg? If it is, it's a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Gutsy, is that true? Th that's incredible! He's superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Gutsy. You may have what it takes to become the champion. You seem to be getting on great with Pokemon, too. You should take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. The closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Gutsy, the road to the championship will be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. Alright. Gutsy, use these on your Pokedex quest. Yes, we can start catching stuff. So I'm probably not going to be catching many Kanto Pokemon. Just because I, I already got them in the previous game. <laughs> that being said, some of them I do need to catch for uh, new evolutions and whatnot. Ma'am! Ma'am, I'm going on a Pokemon journey. Wow, it's a cute Pokemon. Where'd you get it? So you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll help you. But what can I do for you? I know, I'll save money for you. On a long journey, money's important. You want me to save your money? Sure, why not? Okay, I'll take care of your money. Be careful. Pokemon are your friends. You need to work as a team. Now go on. Alright, bye, mother. Hey, 
I've seen you a couple times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Would you like me to show you how to catch Pokemon? Nah, I'm good. I'll find them. Anyway, if you want to catch Pokemon, you have to walk a lot. I heard. Oh. Oh yeah, let's catch this. And it's level two. Let's wait for a better one. Because we need to train it to become a, a knocked owl. It'll, it'll make life easier if we catch it at a higher level. Arlo, where are you? Also level 2. Oh, yeah. Need to catch a spinner act, too. Lots of level two Pokemon. I'd like to catch like a level three or four Pokemon. Can I buy more Pokeballs? Does this guy finally have Pokeballs in stock? He probably does. Yeah, there we go. Let's buy more. We're gonna need a lot more. I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Oh, you poor soul. It's level 4. I'll give him credit for that. Stronger than what's in the wild. Ugh, I don't have any more Pokemon. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? And you have to battle. Forcing me to battle. It's a Pidgey and it's level 2. How'd this guy win against the Rattata? He must have sand tacked the shit out of that rat Rattata. That's the only thing I can think of. So I don't even know if it has sand attack at level 2. You know what I mean? Oh, and now I know why he won. He had more Pokemon.
Hello. I'm not a trainer. But if you look one in the eyes, prepare to battle. Yes, yes. It has been like this for decades. What's up, call me Callum. How's it going, dude? How's the Pokemans going so far? It's doing pretty well. Haven't caught anything here yet. Because, uh, I only need Johto Pokemon right now. Completed the Pokedex back in, uh, Let's Go Eevee, so... Making good progress, I guess. I imagine it's gonna get much more tough in this game. Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee are really easy to complete the Pokedex. can't see any of the Gen 2 games without thinking of Vietnamese Crystal now. I think I might have heard of that somewhere. Is that like a bootleg Pokemon game? I think I might have seen it. Hey, look at Bellsprout. It's an amazing translation, it's so often it's amazing. Wow, nice. Man, that Bellsprout kicked my Croc's ass. Ooh. So I need to catch two Hoot Hoots and two Spinneracks. I caught a bunch of Pokemon, let me battle with you. Crocs can get too strong to catch Pokemon. That's fine. I'm pretty sure I can throw a Pokeball without uh, damaging them this early on. I could use Rage, too. Rage is kind of weak. Having no EXP share is going to be... It's going to make this much more difficult because I have to grind every Pokemon. But I think what I'll do is I'll save all that grinding for after I, like, actually beat the game. That way, the pacing is better. That way, people that want to watch, you know, me actually go through the game will watch. And then people who don't want to watch the grind, they don't have to watch that if they don't want to. For some Pokemon, come on. Give me like a level 4 Hoot Hoot or something. Ooh, a spinner egg, that's kind of rare. I might have to just catch that. Level 4 too. Fantastic. I'm gonna just throw a Pokeball at it. Very good. Gurry looks happy too. It lies still in the same pose for days in its web, waiting for its unsuspecting prey to wander close. Nah. Ooh, there's like a berry tree right there. Come on, run away from this one. 
Uh, I should probably put spin, uh, spin rack in the front. Bitterberry, I forget what Bitterberry does. Hey, you know what Bitterberry does? Huh? I walked too far today looking for Pokemon. My feet hurt and I'm sleepy. If I were a wild Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. I suppose he would. Might do a little bit of grinding here just to get stuff up. Let's see, this should be a good match for a spinner act. Oh, right. Part poison. A lot of XP. It'd probably be easier to switch out and save time. Hey look, another spinner. I need to catch that. It's also level 4. Alright, it's Poison Bug. Uh, go Pokeball. Oh, you bitch! You getting that Pokeball? There we go. No, I didn't want... Now I need two hoot hoots. I gotta remember that the spinner I'm actually training is a female. Owie. Oh yeah. What level is the spinner at Kuroba? I know it's not early like most bug Pokemon. Alright, I don't, I don't need another one of you. Sorry. I'm not bored, I just woke up very early today. Oh, I remember loving the town music in this game. Very unique from any of the others in the series, I, in my opinion. I'm gonna deposit that second spinner act. Ooh. 
later. Alright, let's go back. Gotta catch two Hoot Hoot. One to just stay as a Hoot Hoot, and one to evolve in the Noctowl. Give me like a level 3 or level 4 hoot hoot, that'd be great. Keep giving me freaking bell sprout, dude. Aren't plants supposed to be sleeping at night? Not that they do anything. Plants are supposed to move, so. <laughs> what do I know? Nice little bump there. Get out of here, Rattata. Poison it. Yes. Yes. Succumb to the poison. Let the venom flow through you. Sorry. <laughs> so yeah, this Pokemon's gonna faint, but we in real reality we know what's gonna happen. It fainted and it's poison. That thing died. That thing died. Spinarak straight up killed that Rattata. Scary face. Isn't that lower speed? The same as String Shot. It might like lower evasion, maybe. Ow. Get poison. Ow. Oh, right, this is the older Pokemon games where it's like, your Pokemon goes low, it's like you have to hear that ear bleeding sound until you switch. Heal again. Maybe Hoot Hoot are more rare to pop out in this grass. I wonder if this EXP share in this game later. I know the original did, but it was like an item you had to like use only for one Pokemon or something like that. Or was it for everybody? I can't remember. It was so long ago. Remember in the 90s where everybody wore their baseball cap backwards because it was like cool and everything? Even though it's like pretty much like the opposite of what you should do with a baseball cap because it's supposed to uh, shield your eyes from the light. <laughs> People still wear it like that, I think, too. Hey, that one's level 5. That's That one's mine. Alright, let's uh, let's switch over to the croc because Finrax can get owned by Hoot Hoot because it's a Flying type. I'm, I'm gonna do like a like a rage. Shouldn't it shouldn't destroy it. It's a level five. I should really turn off Discord when I'm streaming. Don't kill it. Ooh, that's perfect. Get in there. Oh, you son of a... 
Don't you be growling at me. You're gonna be a part of this. You are no wild- you're not a wild hoot anymore. You're gonna be mine. And then after I beat this game, you're gonna stay in a box for the rest of your life. It always stands on one foot. It changes feet so fast, the movement can rarely be seen. I always forget that, that it has- it does have two feet. Also, if any one of you guys have a favorite Pokemon in this game, let me know and I will name them after you. Hi guy, did you visit the Proud Tower? Say, hi guy! <laughs> Who's calling me? Oh. Somebody's at the door. Pidgey's your fave? Oh, I'm not gonna be catching a Pidgey though, sorry. But what I will do, if you're on when I come back to Let's Go Eevee for like other stuff, I will name a Pidgey after you. Just remind me. I'm only gonna be catching a Johto Pokemon. Kyoto specific Pokemon. I know there are Pidgeys in this game, but I don't need to catch one. So yeah, like, technically I won't be completing the Pokedex for this game, because I already have all the console Pokemon that appear in this game, I've already caught, so I don't see any purpose in catching them again, so, yeah. Let's see. I'd say we'd probably be good in shape if I got Spinarak and Hoot Hoot to level 8. Because then we could go up Sprout Tower, and then we could do the gym. So we're going to do a little bit grindy. Just a little bit. In these older Pokemon games, you got to grind a little bit at first. Hopefully the spinner act learns like a bug move. Yeah, these bell sprats are good to fight with for a spinner rack. A crit, and it still did the same amount of damage. That's hilarious. Oh yeah, one more level for Spinarak. Spinarak has decent attack. It just sucks that it only has Poison Sting right now. Hopefully, it learns like a move at level eight. Cool. Let's catch this Hoot Hoot. Okay, we need two of them. Yeah, I'm not in a very- let's just throw a Pokeball. I'm sure it's fine. The catch rate on these guys are pretty high, so.
<clears throat> I'm pretty sure I need to catch a slow poke in this so we can evolve it into a uh slow king. I'm just like thinking it aloud. There are like a lot of Gen 1 Pokemon I need to catch because they have a Gen 2 evolution. This is gonna take forever. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna swap over to Hoot Hoot. Which one? Well, this one has more health and it's the same level, so I'm guessing it has better stats somehow. I don't know. How can you miss? Come on. Are you catching him? This Rattata? No. I'm just training right now. Just grinding a bit. Want to make sure Spinarak and Hoodoot are level 8 before I progress anymore. Just so Sprout Tower's not uh, tedious. I keep thinking this guy's like the Pokemon Center guy for some reason. I don't know why. Oh yeah, let me deposit that hoot hoot. Oh yeah. Drink of that venom. <laughs> Just a little bit more for Spinarak. Spinarak's all done with. Hoot 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 up. Hoot hoot. 
What a clever name for a Pokemon. I definitely want to get like a hair across on my team. That's a good Pokemon bug fighting. I already know it's going to be a pain though. Try to get a hair across. Got to make sure to learn headbutt on a Pokemon and not forget it. I'll probably teach it to uh rock. <clears throat> I already know the legendary dogs are going to be real. A real bitch. <laughs> Say that's kind of a useless move, I think. <clears throat> what does Foresight do? Oh, no. I guess I have to check in the menu. I don't think there's a way to check, like, what move does what. You just gotta figure it out, I guess. It's old school. The only way to find out is just to use the move. Alright, you know what? I'm getting a little impatient. Let's just go to Sprout Tower. Who should be fine. Sprout Tower, right? Yes. Experience the way of Pokemon. <laughs> a barrel sprout over 100 feet tall. People say that it became the center pillar here. Yeah, no. See the pillar shaking? People are training upstairs. That would be really alarming for me. Sprout Tower is built long ago as a place for Pokemon training. Only if you reach the top will you obtain an HM. What HM is it? However hard we battle, the tower stands strong. Yeah, I think we should be fine. Tanner battles give way more experience, too. Yeah, yeah, that's way more experience. You're just gonna keep throwing uh, level 3 bell sprouts at me, I guess.
Ooh. Also, I just realized I think they used the wrong uh, stair tile here because that looks like it goes upstairs, but we came, we just came upstairs, so yeah, I think they done goofed it there. You missed. Yes, Hootoot is getting stronger. Now they use the correct tile right here. So I think they did done, done good. Cause see how that looks like I'm going downstairs? I might ride a pee pee. I've already used like half of my tackles. Well, I could always just switch over to Spinner Act. Oh, yeah.
This one's level six, I just realized. Huh. Still didn't really do much. <laughs> Should probably give Hoot Hoot a potion. Ooh, level seven. What's up, Jordan? <laughs> I'm not much of a fan of Hoot Hoot myself, but I gotta catch him and evolve him, so. How you doing? How you doing in silver? Have you started yet? <clears throat> you got it today? Gotcha. Yo, that crit. Buying now. All right, cool. Bring your bring your DS next time you come over, so uh, we can do all those trades and whatnot. Remember, we gotta restart a couple times, or you can come over later. I don't know. Whatever you want, man. And you will not change their names. I mean, you can't change Pokemon's names from you get from trades. So, like, if you name your Pokemon something. Like, hilarious. Like, I'm stuck with it. <laughs> I can't change it. Didn't you know that? Like, it is literally impossible to change a, a traded Pokemon's name. Yeah. So you have full reign over that to give me whatever abomination name the Pokemon that you want. <clears throat> yeah, I'm definitely getting a Ray Pest, huh? I didn't name this guy after you, Jordan, just because you're not really like this guy. You're more like Gary. What the? Yo, a ghastly. Cool. This place is haunted, then. Cool. Oh, he's got no pee pee. I'm not catching any Kanto Pokemon, so... Yeah. Only Johto Pokemon. I already got a Gengar and a Ghastly and a Haunter and whatnot, and... Let's go Eevee, so... Don't need another one. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People in Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I'm the final test. Allow me to check the ties between your Pokemon and you.
Nice. Hoot hoot. Alright, gotta change. Go crack! Ah, excellent. Yes, give me your money. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this flash. Ew, flash. Flash eliminates even the darkest of all places. But to use it out of battle, you need the badge from Violet's gym. Yeah. Do I have an escape rope? I do. Wee! I haven't even checked these houses. What is this? Girls Pokemon can Ew, no. I'm not going in there. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Bellsprout? Want to trade it for my Onyx? No, thanks. Pokemon you get in the trade grows quickly. But if you don't have the right gym badge, they may disobey you. Faulkner from the Violet Pokemon Gym is a fine trainer. He inherited his father's gym and has done a great job with it. Getting that lore. Uh, Spinarak is not a good choice for this gym. It's just Hoot Hoot and Croc. Hey, I'm no trainer, but I can give you some advice. Believe me. If you believe a championship dream can come true, you believe, then listen. The grass type is weak against flying type. Keep this in mind. Okay. This spear is probably gonna wreck Hoot Hoot. Spear of such high attack and Hoot Hoot. Not a very good physical attacker.
Yeah. Maybe I should just leave with the croc. Isn't that the same sprite from Gen 1? <laughs> Who's excited for the Game Awards tomorrow? I'm excited. Then right after that, we have Smash. It's gonna be a good day tomorrow. Hey, it's a Pidgey. Oh, come on, you couldn't have given to me, game? Yeah, Pidgey isn't as good as Spiro early on. But then later on, Pidgey gets much better. Hey, there we go, finally a flying move. Yo, look at this sprite. Like the emo, like, side cover, the eye hair and stuff. I'm Faulkner, the Violet Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. Hey, Waka Bay, how's it going, dude? I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of magnificent bird Pokemon. Don't you mean flying type? What kind of gym leader has the level 7 Pokemon? And he has a hacked Pidgeotto. Yeah, this Pidgeotto is like 10 levels under when it was supposed to evolve. Give me a ton of experience, though. Darn, my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. You mean your dad's hacked Pokemon? Alright, take this. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr Badge. Yay! Raise the attack power of Pokemon. Neat. It also enables Pokemon to use Flash if they have it any time. Here, take this too. TM31?
Mud Slap. Excuse me. Mud Slap. Reduce the enemy's accuracy while it causes damage. Cool. Who can learn Mud Slap? Ah, oh, teach it to Croc, man. Oh, that's right. Uh, TMs are one-time use in this game. That's kind of a shame. Hello, Gutsy. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant's at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? Didn't even wait for me to respond. Just clicked on me. What up, Aid? Gutsy, long time no see. It's only been, like, what, like an hour? Is another favor to ask. Would you take the Pokemon egg? Sure. We discovered that a Pokemon will not hatch until it grows in the egg. It also has to be with other active Pokemon to hatch. Gutsy, the only person we can rely on. Please call Professor Elm when that egg hatches. Hopefully it's a Pokemon that I, I don't have. Because uh, I already, in my Pokemon bank, I already have, like, Buff and uh, Cleffa, I believe. Hopefully it's, like, a Togepi or, like, a Le Elekid or something. Yeah, I have gold version, so you would have to get silver, Jordan. I wonder if, like, trading is available yet for me. This is for trading. This must be for battling. Yeah. I guess we can trade early on. How does this work on the 3DS? I'm pretty sure you just need the... Before opening Link, you must save your game. Sure. I don't believe you can do this long distance. I think you have to be, like, next to each other to do it. Invite a partner to play with you. Yeah, you have to be in the same... Yeah, I just got in the bottom screen, like... Okay. Wait. Yeah, because I saw, like, the little icon on the menu. You have to be literally in the same room. So, Jordan, uh... Whenever you get a chance, just come over so we can trade. Fine, I'll be social then. <laughs> But it looks like you can trade early on, so we can get the starters, like, traded pretty early. Well, escape ropes are expensive, jeez. Treat your Pokemon with love. So, is the egg in my inventory now? Yes, it is. I wonder how many steps you have to take for it to hatch. I, I always forget this kind of stuff. An odd tree is blocking the way to Goldenrod City. It's preventing me from shopping. Something should be done about it. I gotta remember to say before I... Attempt to catch Sudo Wudo. Wah hey! I was going to snap that tree with my straight arm punch, but I couldn't. I'm a failure. <laughs> Wah hey! <laughs> there it is. Old man. Did you see that strange tree in the road? That may explain why fewer people are visiting the ruins of Al. Ah. Don't you wonder who made- who did make something like this? And why? Make what? Oh, this place. Oh yeah, we can catch unknown in here. 
Mystery stone panel chamber. Ruins of Alf Research Center. The authority on the Ruins of Alf. We're gonna catch some unknown. I'm just gonna catch one. That's all I really need. The ruins are about 1,500 years old. But it's not known why they were built or by whom. So apparently there's an unknown for every letter of the English alphabet. But uh, they don't count anything towards the Pokedex. So I'm just gonna catch one. Now I get... No, dude. That's... That's crazy. I'm not doing that. There are odd patterns drawn on the walls of the ruins. They must be the keys for unraveling the mystery of the ruins. I ain't doing that. I'll be here all day. Or all night. Welcome to this chamber. There are sliding panels that depict a Pokemon drawn by the ancients. It's a complete dex. Yeah, that doesn't matter if the unknown is uh completed. Not even Danny has that shit. I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be a, a Kabuto. Hey! Come on, it's just 10 bucks. You'll have fun. Oh! There's a strange presence here. You can see unknown all over the walls. You know what $10 can get you? Lots of things. This supposed to be like a D. Get in there. Their shapes look like hieroglyphs. Hieroglyphs, yeah. On an ancient tablets. It is said that the two are somehow related. The first to fire thing. I guess so, you get a Syndicle. I think there's just only unknown in here. What's this supposed to be? I mean, what do you expect? It's like, I don't think it's even a megabyte, Jordan. I'll catch at least one more. I know I should be able to get uh, a whooper around this area. Not in the Ruins of Alpha, but like in this general route. No, no nickname. Just want to see if there's like any items in here.
that's like an E or something. Pressing a bunch of buttons. I don't want to give many nicknames. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else in here. There might be like hidden items, but I don't have an item finder. And I'm not about that old school, just like clicking on every uh, tile. Does anyone ever actually use Unknown in their team, actually? You know, when I was a kid, I thought that every Pokemon could get good eventually. Boy, did I learn the wrong, like... Boy, did I learn that the wrong way. Hmm? That's a Pokedex, isn't it? May I see it? There are so many kinds of Pokemon. Hmm? What's this? What is this Pokemon? It looks like the strange writing on the walls of the ruins. If those drawings are really Pokemon. There should be many more. I know. Let me upgrade your Pokedex. Follow me. <clears throat> Done. I modified your Pokedex. I added an optional Pokedex to store unknown data. It records them in the sequence that they were caught. Oh, so now I can see the different unknown I catch. The unknown you catch will all be recorded. Check to see how many kinds exist. Oh. 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 I think I might have to do this now. Once again, no death. So I need to, like, fill all of this. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, not right now, though. There are drawings on so yeah, I already, I already figured that out. I solved something that scientists couldn't solve. You're studying the ruins? I see a scientist in the making. Yeah, I already solved their problem. <clears throat> there should be like Whooper in here. Top 5 Gen 2 Pokemon. <coughs> I don't know. I'll start with Ampharos. Ampharos is pretty cool. Uh, what's that other one? Oh yeah, it's a Wooper. I'm gonna catch this. Um, Ampharos. Then it what? Heracross. Heracross is cool as hell. Umbreon, yeah. Umbreon's pretty cool. Espeon's very cool as well. Jordan, you said you're going for Umbreon, so I'm getting I'm getting a Espeon. So we can trade them. Let's see. Pokeball. Now I'm pretty sure I don't need to train Wooper, because later on in the game I will find Quagsire in the wild, so. 
Hope hopefully I'm right on that. This Pokemon lives in cold water. It will leave the water to search for food when it gets cold outside. I haven't seen your run before. So you think you're pretty tough? I think I'm plenty tough. Oh yeah, we gotta catch a zoo bat and train it until it becomes a crow bat. I think I'll just catch a gold bat later on in the game and do that. I'm not gonna catch a zoo bat. Pretty sure you can find a gold bat easily later on. Give me list, or are we doing it over at your place? We'll do it at my place, because we have to be next to each other for it anyway. Uh-huh, yeah, and, you know, pardon, battle? I'm on the phone. All right, but make it fast. <laughs> Ma'am! Ma'am, hold on! Hold on, I'm fighting! Hold on, I'm in a Pokemon battle! <laughs> Ma'am! That is a derpy looking Nidoran. Got gold in my 3DS, nice. No, I can't pause, okay? This is real life, what are you talking about? So got to use it, nice. This is my favorite gen, honestly. This is such a good sequel for the time. Still is, it still holds up. And we got the, the Gen 4 Remix too, which I have the Gen 4 Remix, but because of how difficult it is to transfer the Pokemon in Gen 4, I decided not to play that version, just play this version that I can just, I can transfer the Pokemon Pokebank pretty easily in this version. Which good good on good on Nintendo and Game Freak to to do that. They did they really didn't have to do that. It's the best sequel for a game, I honestly believe. Yeah, it's literally one like when I think of good game sequels, Poke definitely Gold and Silver. Uh they they, they go on that list. Hold on, let me pull up a guide. I need to know what Pokemon spawn on this route. That way I don't do any backtracking later in the game. Let's see. Uh, Gen 2 Pokemon Guide. I had something pulled up a couple days ago. I don't remember what website. No, not Pokemon Go. God damn it. Better list. No, not Pokemon Go. God damn it.
whatever, I'll look, I'll look later. I don't want to bog down the stream looking at that. I'll, I'll find one later and I'll bookmark it. If I have to go back, so be it. You know what? After this battle, I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a little break. We've been streaming for about two hours. I need to stand up and stretch and stuff. Yo, look at look at this young, this camper Roland. Look at his pose. I'm gonna fight you, man. <laughs> oh man, these poses. That's a good looking Nidoran. Yo, Lear looks amazing. It's just like a laser beam from your eyes. Alright guys, I'm gonna take a 10 minute break. I'm gonna go walk around, use the restroom, get some more water. Uh, I suggest you guys do the same. Let's everybody just take a 10 minute break. Stand up and stretch and whatnot. I will be right back.
All right, I'm back. Thanks for waiting, guys. While I was gone, I did end up finding that guide I was uh, looking for, for the uh, Pokedex. Let me look at the map, see what route I'm on. Route 32, so we're gonna go to 32 on Jodo. Right here. And we want Gen 2. Apparently in the daytime I can get Mareep and Hop Hit. Hop it. So that's gonna have to wait till tomorrow, right as we start, I guess. But other than that, we have the Whooper. The other two are daytime only. Alright. Sounds good. Let's keep going. That just means I don't have to worry about Cash and Pokemon for now. Just battling. Ooh, level 10, huh? Man. Croc doesn't even have Water Gun yet. How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail? For you right now, just one... Let's see, one million poke dollars. You'll want... No. You don't want it? Then scram, shoo! Well, screw you, guy. Oh, yeah, we got a great ball. I didn't know that was there, I just figured, like, it was... Uh, this place just screamed, hidden item. Yeah, gotta catch a slowpoke. This is a great fishing spot. You saw people fishing? How about you? Would you like to one yes, give me one of your rods. What should I make my Pokemon hold? Maybe an item that increases the attack power? Oh, right, yeah, you can give them items that increase elemental attacks and whatnot. That badge, it's from Violet City. You beat Faulkner? Yeah, statistically, you should have been able to beat Faulkner, too. These Pokemon weren't anything special. Alright, I think I'm gonna put 
spinnerack in the front. <coughs> Hoot Hoot's gotten enough training now. Union cave ahead. Potion! Hello. I don't like this theme. Whoa, what a surprise. I didn't expect to see anyone here. Can Spinarak defeat this Onyx? I don't know about that, but we're gonna try. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Man, Croc doesn't have Water Gun yet. Oh, it's stuck with Bind. How long does that uh, bind last? Hey, Shy One, how's it going? Good to see you. Yes. Oh, is this bind still going? Can I switch out now? No. Spinak, you might die. Yes. I think Rage is probably the way to go with this fight, since I don't have Water Gun yet. Oh, I got Mud Slap. Is that gonna do it? anything? Oh yeah, cool. We're back in business then. Nice. How are you enjoying Let's Go Eevee? Water gun! I'm doing great. I'm having fun with this game. Excited for the Game Awards tomorrow. And then Smash, like, later on. I, uh, I got Friday off from work, so I'm gonna be playing Smash all day.
I will, uh... I will give Spinrack some of that, uh, drip feed XP. Just bummed out. Oh, Kangaskhan ran away. Oh, man. That sucks. Okay, let's just try again. You'll get it eventually. Just remember the berries. I was actually really disappointed that I got Kangaskhan off camera. Because, like, I would have loved for you guys to see my reaction to Kangaskhan just popping out in a... I think it was a rock tunnel. Pretty sure it was the rock tunnel. But like it just popped up there. I just I literally was like, oh But yeah, if I had a second Kangaskhan, uh, I would just trade it to you right now. But uh, I don't. I only have the one. Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. The devs are aware. The devs are aware how much people hate that crap. Don't you dare use, like, a poison attack on me. That's right. You take that mud slap. I know you're a poison type and ground types destroy you. I was so bummed out because I never had Kangaskhan in gold or in this game, so I was. Yeah, I had never, ever caught Kangaskhan, like, ever, because I know in old school red and blue, that thing was, like, impossible to catch. Because it was in the Safari Zone. I hated the Safari Zone. I'm gonna have to deal with it in this game, too, I think. Sorry for the ear rape, guys. I know the beeping's annoying. Cool, I'll check it out. Ooh, Constrict. Oh yeah, double levels. We've almost got a... an evolved Pokemon here. We got an item run down here. Picks. Ooh. Yo, Quick Attack looks cool in this game.
Ember looks cool too. Oh, you burn me, you son of a... I don't have any burn hero. Son of a bitch burned my Pokemon. Wait, before I go out of here, I gotta... Gotta check out this other guy over here. Hello. That sounds like pedo music. That's like straight up like pedophile music. <laughs> I don't know why. Hey, we need one of those. I think this guy's gonna outlive me. Survive? Oh god. Yeah, yeah, no. Get in here, Croc. I know you're burned, but. Does uh, burn still lower your attack in this? This far back? I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it was like a Gen 1 thing, right? Jesus. Yeah. Spinarak? Oh, God. It's time to prove yourself, Spinarak. <laughs> That, uh, that Slowpoke was tanky as hell. I should know. Slowbro is, like, one of my best Pokemon in Let's Go Eevee. Ooh, a Sandshrew. Don't need it, though. I already have a Sandshrew in Let's Go. Hopefully, the... Poke Bank will become compatible, otherwise I'll probably have to go back and catch all those again in like o OG Red or something. Well, actually, no, I could probably catch it like in uh, like a, a later gen or something. It'll probably be easier that way, but uh, still, that would suck if they never made it compatible with, uh, with the bank. I really hope they do, because that'd be kind of a dick move. Oh, there's an item over there. No, thank you. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm surprised I haven't seen any Zubats in here. Usually, like, that'd be the most common Pokemon. The game does not want me to leave this cave.
Berry tree. More pizzen cure berry. The translator just like was not having it that day. He was like, I don't want to translate whatever crap this is. Pizzen cure berry. What route am I on right now? Route 33. So, go back to my little, my little cheat sheet here. Route 33 in Johto. Nothing new. I need to come back when it's daytime for a hop kip. First, a uh oh, uh, hoot oh, hoot. I need a that's a good machop spray. Eat that. Oh, <laughs> why? <laughs> why? Stop it. Uh, peck. Oh, why didn't you kill it? Oh, <laughs> no. Oh god. It's not looking good. I'm I might die. Uh Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Oh god. No. Well, it's up to these two unknown. Yeah. Oh, it's actually Wow. Oh, you flip! Why'd you flinch? Yeah. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. We're dying. We're dying. Somehow, like, crit this thing. Oh god. Oh no! I gotta give this guy my money. Oh, I gotta go through that cave again. Oh, no. I lost a lot of money. Ow. Damn it, I need to go through the cave again. My Pokemon healed. They're okay, they just lost their pride. My pride. That hasn't happened to me in a very long time. Don't look at me, guys. Don't look at me! I'm ashamed. Yeah, I lost a lot of money. 
getting whited out. Oh god, just let me leave the cave, please. Yes. You son of a bitch. You killed my Pokemon and I will have my revenge. It's too bad I won't get my money back. I, I blame, I blame that one dude in the cave that burned my croc. Croc would have been good if it wasn't for that burn. That damn Vulpix. Hey. Maybe now Hoot Hoot can get his re or her revenge. Kill it, Hoot Hoot. Kill it. Kill it. Seriously. Them a chop is. Scary. It's strong. Oh! What do you want, ma'am? Hi, Gutsy. How are you? I found a useful item shopping, so I bought it with your money. Sorry. It's in your PC. You'll like it. See, that's the cool thing about uh, the Pokemon universe. It's like, hey, I bought you something. I'm just gonna put it in your computer, and you can materialize it at another computer. That's so freaking cool. I, I wish we lived in that timeline. <laughs> I love this town's music. And it's Team Rocket. It's unsafe to go in there, so I'm standing guard. Aren't I a good Samaritan? Yeah, I know what you're up to. Let's, uh, let's deposit these unknown. Let's see what mom sent me. Where'd you send me, mother? A super potion? Mom, I needed that earlier. You were a little late with that. Bill's PC can store up to 20 Pokemon per box. Oh, right. I need to change boxes, don't I? I need to, like... I need to, like, uh... Make sure I know how many Pokemon... I have need. Does it transfer automatically? No, it didn't do that in this gen, did it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven. So I can catch 13 more Pokemon. God, that's annoying. I don't think we have to deal with that after this gen. All right, you know what? I'm going to end it here for today. Getting pretty hungry. I know I started a little bit late today, so it's a little bit on the short side, but... What can I say? I have to I have to work tomorrow. I need to eat and whatnot. So thank you so much for watching, guys. I will be back tomorrow at around 5.30 p.m. Eastern. We'll play some more of this. Uh, I will probably be uh, streaming the Game Awards, too, because that's at 8.30 tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, we'll probably stream that, too. We'll watch it together if, you, if you'd like. 
So until then, thank you very much, and I will see you next time. Bye.